Well, before we start this declaration, there's. I was trying to find the scripture. It, uh, it says that divine power lives within us. Divine power. So we declare that we acknowledge that divine power in making these decrees. Okay, and show his name. Okay. Father, there's these times of troubles and very bad governance of Canada. And it has necessitated this decree in order to allow the kingdom of God work, the work to be going forward, to being able to clean up the mess. And decisions uh, in occupying the land that are of promise for the kingdom. The Canadian government has declared itself power hungry, divisive, hostile, belligerent, deceptive, and they've declared themselves corrupt in every sense of the word. The Prime Minister flaunts himself as indestructible, even by the will of heaven. We confess this, the iniquity of our country and the anxiety created by leaders and their prideful sins. And therefore, we decree that, one, even though our enemies pridefully flaunt themselves as wise and powerful, their evil plans are to be exposed and neutralized because Yeshua is stronger, wiser, and he's just. Amen. 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 Point two. With maliciousness of forethought, our leaders have plotted to destroy truth, um, the bringers of truth, and the knowledge of our God from this land. <laughs> Therefore we decree, Isaiah 10.1, Woe to those who enact evil mandates, statutes, regulations, judgments, laws, policies, orders, and create contemptuous news releases. And to those leaders who accuse and plant troublemakers in order to record and uh, publish unjust decisions. We are against them and declare their woe is upon them. In Yeshua's name, amen. 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 Decree number three. We decree the curse of backlash to come heavily and swiftly on all those who oppress freedom, deny the rights of your word, deny justice according to the constitutional law. And we decree this in Yeshua's name, that backlash is theirs. Amen. 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 Yes, amen. Number four. We decree a seven times reimbursement to all who have suffered loss because of confiscation or freezing of, by the, on their bank accounts, on their um, 
investment funds, and from any um, acts of terrorization that the government has performed. This we have to take real note of. They, they are causing our police to be oath-breaking police. Mm -hmm. Our RCMP are oath-breaking. Our judges are breaking their oath of office. And agents sworn to uphold the Constitution are breaking their promises and oaths. And we declare and decree this must stop now and that all their evil be exposed. Amen. 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 Number five, we decree Genesis 12, 2. We are to be a great nation obeying God, a blessed nation of prosperity, strength, and integrity. We are blessed to be a blessing to the world. In verse 3, and we decree that Yeshua will bless those who bless us, and he will curse with a curse of total failure all who have decided to curse us for believing in Yeshua, to hinder us, to accuse us, who slander us, who demean us, who shall we say, seek to declare shame over us for obeying God and who seek to deceive all of Canada and all who seek to take us out of God's will and see that prosperity does not touch us. These are agents of Satan and we decree that the hand of justice from Yeshua land upon them in full forms of justice. That they will know it is God that has taken action against them. We decree our ownership and authority over Canada as in Joshua 1, verse 5 and 6. Rejoice, for no man will ever be able to stand opposing you all the days of your life. We claim that promise and decree it is ours. Amen. Amen. For just as I was with Moses, so I'll be with every believer. And I will never fail, fail you nor forsake you. We claim that promise and decree it is ours. Verse 6. Be strong. Be courageous and do not fear. Rely on me and you shall give these people possession, rulership, and peace in Canada, which I have sworn to your forefathers. And this is our land under the rule of Yeshua. He is the supreme owner of all. Amen. 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 Decree 7. We decree Psalm 40, verse 4. How abundantly blessed is the man, the faithful believer, who has made Yeshua his trust and not his flesh nor the deceptive lie of demon-inspired rulers, nor 
trusted in vaccines, nor become a seeker of bribes and money schemes. He has visited the proud. That's Yeshua. He has visited the proud, the bullheaded, the mockers who honor themselves in self-righteousness and the public relation falsehoods that they web around them. We are the blessed who decree an end to their seductive games as we are here to occupy as the kingdom of God and take over. And we decree this shall stand. Amen. 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 Decree number eight. We decree Psalm 41.1. How excellently blessed is the believer who considers compassionately the needs of the helpless, the poor, the homeless, for his prayers will cause Yeshua to deliver them speedily in a day of troubles. And we're in this day of troubles. Mm -hmm. The active believer shall not be released to the evil desires of his enemies. We are the righteous who oppose the workings of demon principalities and evil rulers who obey them. And we decree they shall not stand. Amen. Number nine. We decree Psalm 43.1. Vindicate your believers, Yeshua. Bring justice to our cause, our case, our needs, and our petitions against the ungodly nation, its enforcers, that hate Yeshua, hate believers, and hate your laws. Deliver us from the unjust con man who temporarily um, hides in government power and heads up government power, those ones. We, or why do we anguish in mourning and shame because of the corruption of our enemies. We decree, Yeshua, judge now and free your people. You are our Savior. Amen. 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 Decree number 10. We decree our thanks as in Colossians 2, 14 and 15. Yeshua, having canceled out all the certificates of debt consisting of decrees against us, wicked mandates, unjust laws, labels of hatred, and police orders designed to be hostile to us. And in our thankfulness, Yeshua, in our thankfulness, Yeshua has taken it out of our way. For he, he has, uh, have, he having nailed it to the cross, announced it as paid in full. He's going to have to do something. When he has disarmed the rulers, authorities, and uh, malicious uh, instigators of wickedness, he made a public display of them, having triumphed over them and the demons controlling them. And the saints rejoiced in the honor and the victory 
from Yeshua. So we are going to be rejoicing in that. Amen. 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 We thank you, Father, for your promise. I will never leave you, desert you, nor will I ever forsake you. Therefore, we confidently claim Yeshua is my helper, my defender, my rescuer, my savior. I shall not be afraid, for what shall man do to me? When we have God on our side, an all-powerful God on our side, and all this is now decreed in Yeshua's name. Amen, amen. and amen. 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 amen.